All right, let's see how we can evaluate what we get here from compression out of our MV stock forks. So one of the great things about doing this is that you can quickly discover where and how much your compression works. So, and I can't tell you how many people I've seen with stitches and written to me with complaints of a broken windshield. When you're pushing on the bike, your right leg is gonna stay back. Okay, that gave us a distance of 50 millimeters. The purpose of that screw going down into the hole is to impair or slow flow rate. Now let's see if we get a difference with the same energy. I can feel that. So when you do test compression, make sure sag is set first. One of the great confusions with a shock is how do I tell whether my compression is right or wrong? So now you're really fine tuning the range of adjustment that feels best to you by making data point changes, knowing what you're doing and where you're ending up. But realize again, as the shock oil ages, that compression setting is gonna go slightly firmer with older oil because when it gets hot, it gets thinner.